Well, thank you for that amazing introduction, Miraculous Girl. And thank you everyone for joining us again here on Exploring It All. Uh, today we are going to be, you know, it's the middle of the month and uh, <laughs> it's also the end of May of 2022. Well, the middle of May of 2022, but it's the end of the school year for Miraculous Girl. So I am currently going to be filming a few videos ahead of time. Uh, that we are going to be posting. So just letting you know, I'm filming this here on May 15th, but uh, it may not be posted until a little bit later this month. So uh, it's the middle of the month, and the middle of the month is kind of a slow time. Uh, there's not a lot of subscriptions coming in. Uh, so, But today we are going to be taking a look at... Uh, some products from the Grim Workshop. And I, I think I might have got these on sale. I haven't opened this up yet. Uh, but I thought we would take a look at a few items. Like I said, this isn't a sub or anything like that. Uh, I'm opening this with this Petrified Fish G10 D2 Flipper. Uh, this is one of the smaller Petrified Fish ones I've, I've got. But it stands out the most with these orange and G10 mixed uh, scales. I like this one. Anyway, those uh, are some fun knives. So, like I said, we ordered a few things here. We ordered a few things here. Um, <laughs> I have a subscriber. He always cracks up. We get one packing peanut in here, uh, and we are back. I haven't seen this for a couple of months. We're back to getting our uh, business card that is also set up to be a cordage or tape or whatever type of EDC you would like to wrap around it so this card actually has a, a purpose. Like I said, we're not doing uh, the subscription one this month. I just ordered a couple of items. Uh, I may have got on sale. Ever since I retired, I slimmed down my wallet because I don't carry as much stuff now. And I've been carrying a little thinner EDC style wallet. And here's another one. I just ordered this. Uh, this one happens to have the Grim Workshop logo on it. Make sure nothing's exposed here that is important. This is the one I've been carrying. Uh, so, just to show. And uh, I just thought I'd get another one. So, this I think that I think that other one might have actually came in a pocket box. I like them. These are leather. It's real leather. You can smell the real leather in it. I like the smell of it. Nothing beats that smell. So anyway, so we got this little uh, EDC wallet. Now I also purchased two of these. I showed it in a previous video. This is a line card. It has uh, 12 yards of waxed line. Let's see what it says on here. Uh, this line contains 12 yards of high strength wax line that can be deployed either as a fishing line or used as thread for sewing. Um, and it's credit card size. It does have a little pocket window on it here. And part of the reason that I purchased this is I got another sewing card in our sub this month. And um, I don't know what the actual strength is on this. And it actually has a little cutter built into it here. But this is great little line, a uh, little wax line here that you can use for for different things. Uh, and you could probably fluff it up as a fire starter. I think that's really convenient kind of item. And these cards are very inexpensive. It was $4.95. Uh, for the card. Um, with this, 
obviously you could run some line around this uh, and create your own. You don't have to carry this card, but I just kind of thought it was kind of neat. And it's kind of convenient to have throw in a kit. Uh, it'll fit in an Altoids tin, things of that sort. So that's the first item is, is this wax line. And then next up, I got from the Grim Workshop. Now, these work in conjunction, or designed to work in conjunction with the Exotac uh, x reel Forgot the name of it there for a second. And this was a couple of, these are new. Now, these are direct from the Grim Workshop and not through Exotac. And so they the original ones were $20. These were $14.99, and I think I might have got them on a sale. Um, I forget. I put the originals. This is the X reel, and I put the original. Uh, I attached it inside here, and there's another one in here. My little fishing kit that has some hooks and whatnot. So these are the two original ones. This was the gaff fishing one, and this one was hooks and lures and stuff. Uh, this one has a hooked lure already hooked, and it has two other lures, a little bit bigger than the ones we got before, and then one really large one. Uh, and then one, two, three, four hooks in there. So that's kind of cool. Um, so we got that one. And then this other one is just lures. It doesn't include hooks, and there's four of them here. And I'm thinking about maybe even trying to paint these. See what happens there. And here's another one, and this one has four different lures on it. I guess I'm bringing it up here. They are shiny. You could probably bend and curve these, throw some hooks on them. Uh, some of the areas where Miraculous Girl and I have gone backpacking, um, you're only allowed to use artificial lures. Uh, you can use flies, obviously, but, but you're only allowed to use flies and artificial lures. You're not allowed to use any kind of baits. Okay, reel it in. Um, in the uh, Golden Trout Wilderness where we usually do our backpacking and camping. Now these, uh, these tools have an adhesive on the back. That's how these are attached in there. And I'm already attached these two in here. So, I so like I said, this has an adhesive back on here so you can peel it up and stick it inside. And then also this, look, the backing where the lures are, this is also adhesive in there. These peel up like that, and then you, when you, you're done, if you want, you can stick it right back on there, and it will stay on. So that's kind of cool. I, with these ones, are mostly the lure cards. If I were to get, and I kind of wanted one in orange, one of these X reels in orange. I keep waiting to see if it shows up in a in a subscription box one of these days. Um, that would be kind of cool. Although it retails for about $100, so that's probably wishful thinking. And then let's bring this one up a little bit closer here for you guys to get a look at as well. I enjoy these kind of kits and cards. I like these kind of things. That's why I subscribe to it. Um, I have... We took a trip and it was not in the right circumstance to really try and test this out. Um, but maybe on one of our next uh, fishing trips, we will test out this little X reel and see if we can't uh, 
catch some fish with it and get it on get it on camera that would be great uh, anyway so that's a look at these two new updates and there are I, I want to say a few more of these cards these are the main fishing ones uh, there are a couple of more that are more in gear toward hunting and, and whatnot um, I feel like the fishing ones are more eh, compliant with this So guys, that's another look at the Grim Workshop uh, Exotac collaboration, I'm going to call it. Like I said, these ones here came directly through Grim Workshop and are a little bit less than the original release that was only through Exotac. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. Uh, give us a like, give us a subscribe, and remember, be nice to each other.